First, we'll start with turning the integration on. Before turning on the integration, you'll want to sign up and set up an account in Xero. If you don't have an existing account, you can visit their website and set up a free trial account using the Try Zero for Free button. Before you link your Venn store, you will need to quickly configure some settings in your Xero account. First, you'll need to set up your tax rates in Vend. If you haven't set up your tax rates in Vend, this is an important step that can't be missed. Make sure you check out the Setting Up Your Vend Store Vend U course and look at the Setting Up Taxes modules. You will need your tax rates set up in Xero to activate the integration. Create your taxes in Xero by going to your settings in Xero, clicking on tax rates, and naming your tax rate display name. Enter in the name of your tax under tax components and add in the percentage. Ensure that you do not click on compound. A refund account is essential too. To set one up, visit your chart of accounts in Xero and add a new account. Set the account type as current asset, give it a unique code, and name it refunds. Finally, make sure you have enable payments ticked and save the new account. Make sure that all your payment types you've set up in Xero have the enable payments to this account box ticked. If left unticked, this will affect your integration, so make sure you go through each one. Now that you have completed the necessary steps, you're able to turn on the integration. Navigate to Vend and click Setup and then Add-ons. Choose Zero from the top of the list and click Add to Vend. From here, you'll need to add your Zero account details. You've now activated the integration. We'll now take you through a few important steps to make sure everything is configured correctly. Please bear in mind, however, that dealing with accounting is for experts in accounting. So it's always a good idea to consult with an accountant as well. Now, you have to decide which accounts to send your sales, payment type totals, and purchases to. If you set up any new accounts in Xero, after activating the integration, you will need to click Reload Accounts in Vend to update your account mappings. Next, you'll have to map your different accounts from Vend to Xero. This can be tricky, so it's best to ask an accountant for advice so you can make sure that your mappings make sense. You should already have set up a refund account in Xero as well. You want to now map out your separate accounts. As we scroll through, you can see a number of different accounts that we need to map. After you've done so, up the top, you'll notice you also need to map your tax rates to an account in Xero. You need to have already set up your tax rates in Xero to do this. Remember, when setting up your taxes, you need to make sure that your tax rates in Vend match up to the tax rates that you have entered in Xero. There's also an option if you want to remove tax from the sale of some products. 